Okay, so when you walk in to the right of the door, I have my hooks. They're just dowels cut down, and then I used a double-ended screw to screw them into the wall. And I have my everyday bag from Arden, um, my uh, Kankin backpack, which is from Atmosphere. I got it on clearance for like 50 bucks. My blue Lululemon fanny pack, that's the one that I wear to the gym. I like the, the bright blue one so that I don't get my gym bag mixed up with anybody else's. And then I just have like a little grocery bag that I use when I go get groceries. And then you come over here. This candle is from Dollarama. Um, it's like available right now for Valentine's Day. Same with the jar is available right now from Dollar Tree. And the little rainbow is actually last summer's collection from Michaels. So I don't think it's available anymore. The mirror is an Umbra mirror. They have it at um, Chapters, but I got it at Winners for $99. And then over here, I have this plant pot from Ikea. The plant is also from Ikea. The candle is from Dollar Tree. And the books are just two books that I already owned. I just took the dust cover off. So that's Jeanette McCurdy's book and I believe The Adventures of Opting Out. Over here, I have my mini fridge that has my flower stickers and my Nespresso next. Uh, virtual next in the navy blue the little canisters over here are from canadian tire i got them when they were 50 percent off so it was 20 dollars for the three set and then i have two of the um caramel syrups because honestly because i just wanted free um one day shipping on amazon and i needed to up my order amount so i just got two and then the other syrups over there are from winners over here, the acrylic shelves, they're pretty small. I should have got the 22 inch, but they are from Amazon. And the Squishmallows are from Superstore, Save on Foods, and Save on Foods again, I believe. The white one's from Superstore. So cute. Um, and then this is from Ikea. This frame is from HomeSense, and then the print in it is actually a sticker that I sell in my Etsy shop. And then I have this plant, which the cup is from Dollar Tree, and the plant is from Ikea. Over here, I just have my little garbage that has my pods, like it's a bag for Nespresso. And then I have my nightstand with one of my slippers under it, because my sister's dog stole the other one. I have no idea where it went. But this is an Ikea nightstand. The little knobs are from Winners. I believe it was like a six-pack for like ten bucks. And the... Tissue box cover is from Dollarama. Coming over to this wall, I have all of my books. The chest right there holds like my Wii stuff, um, which is from the thrift store. And then all of my books, I usually get them from Winners or Amazon, but there are a few that I got from Chapters. Um, they're just a lot cheaper on Amazon. My TV is a 55 inch, I believe. And then I have my Apple TV on the top. And then I just have my makeup bag there, it's just chilling. The dog bed is from PetSmart and then he has his little food bowl, which is not normally on his bed, but I just put it there. And then his dog toys are usually from Winners. And then the blankets on his bed, are, I crocheted those for him, so he loves those. This is my like accordion style closet door. The knobs are from Home Depot. They're not like the right knobs for this type of door, but I thought they, they looked cute. So I put them on anyway, even though it's not really easy to open. In this corner down here, I have a little table. This is from Real Canadian Superstore. It was from their summer collection. So these are my plants. So the very small snake plant is from Ikea. It comes in the little white pot. The giant one is from Ikea as well. And the pot is also from Ikea. And then the pink one, it was a like clay colored one before, but I just took the pot off of it and put one from H&M Home on it. Then my window, it's gonna be really bright, but the lights are from Canadian Tire and the curtain panels are from Ikea. They're just like an oatmeal color. They're just like a nice beige. And then we go over here, my heating pad is under my nightstand and then it's the exact same nightstand. I have my Stanley cup and my swig cup. Yeah, my swig cup with my tea in it. And then it's like the same setup. So I have the tissue box from Dollarama and then this lamp, which is really cute. It has like, a, like an Edison style bulb in it. Oh, it's not on, but. I unplugged it, but it is from Ikea, and then I just have a charger base from Amazon that charges my watch, my AirPods, and my phone. 
And then when you come over here, I have this table tray from Ikea. I like using it to edit my videos because I still live with a bunch of people, so I usually stay in my room and it's just nice to have a table. And then up here, that is the arch. This mirror, I get a lot of questions on my TikTok. It is from HomeSense, but I got it like two or three years ago now, so I'm not sure they have it anymore. And then coming down here, this blanket is from HomeSense as well. The purple one is from Ikea. The two giant sham pillows are also from HomeSense. And then this pillow is from Ikea. This pillow is from H&M Home. And my white duvet and sheets and everything are from Ikea. So I usually get my bedding from Ikea. And I thought I'd just mention it. If you don't know what HomeSense is, it's just home goods. It's literally the same store. They have the same stuff. Um, but it's just the Canadian version of it, so that is everything. The only thing I didn't mention are my dressers. They're from um, Ikea. They're two separate moms because I decided to get the two because I wasn't sure what like setup we were going to have when we move out because we're going to be moving into a condo. So I thought having them two separate ones would be better because if we want to move them into two different rooms, we can do that. And honestly, just the condos in our area are super, super small. So I thought it'd be the best use of our space to have them separate. And then the other thing is this floating shelf is from Home Depot. It's pretty expensive. I think it's like $80, um, but it's holding up pretty well. But yeah, that is everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this room tour. I hope it gave you some inspo if you're going for the Danish pastel look. And I will see you guys in next week's video.